been changing our video. Today I'm gonna I got a surprise for you again. I'm gonna have to leave some New York City for a week, so I mean it's all gonna be on Christmas Day, so instead I just decided to just unbox now this new Nintendo 3DS XL. So if I just go in black, I got in Walmart for a little. And it's one of my favorite 3DSs, but it is also one of the most expensive 3DSs on the market. It costs $200. That's right. For an extra $100, you can get two the Nintendo Switch for $300. So it's kind of a hard sell. But the issue is it's that it doesn't come with an AC adapter, which means you have to buy one separately, or it could be, be like me, because I have my own. So, yeah, so, get the AC adapter before buying the new Nintendo 3DS XL. It's because it no longer comes with a clue one, just like what the old 3DSs do. So, up on the back, you have all the same applications, but it's still the exact same. But it's, the box is just a little bit smaller, so. So, in my entire life on YouTube, this is the first time. I've been an un unboxing video, so yeah, I've never done an unboxing video before, so I just open this guy up. Oh, there we go. Yeah, like I said, no more AC adapter. So I'm using it to the system for last. So, yeah. so right here inside, you have the eight AR cards. So these are the Things for the AR games application on the 3DS. So this is included with every 3DS system with the new Nintendo 3DS. Or, yeah, blah blah blah. The 3DS family. It's just ah. Uh, there we go. Yeah, there it is. Find the AR cards. So this one's easy. Yeah, this is this is the important AR cards. So do not bend them. So we have a Mario one, Link, Kirby. Samus and the blue, red, and yellow Pikmin. So, yes. Yeah, so. Alright, so. Let's get the so, we have the uh, instruction manual. <laughs> I don't know what the uh, heck is this, yeah. Yeah, skip the manual, it's just like crap. Now, last but not least, we can go to the system. Oh my god, this is what I'm ready for. Ugh, okay. So, yes, yeah, this is all. And there it is. The new Nintendo 3DS XL. Yeah. Even this all does have a little stylus. Yeah, but with the new Nintendo 2DS XL, it's just way smaller, way uncomfortable to hold. Yeah, instead of having the top, you have to put the cards on the bottom. So yeah, you saw you have the Z buttons, L buttons, and you have the plug for the AC adapter. You saw the power button. Let's have the camera lens to just a little bit small. So I love the black version, but I'm disappointed there's no blue version in North America. It's only in the Asian parts of the world. So yeah, if you want the blue, you have to go to Asia to get them. So yeah. So which means you have to go with the black. So it's, this is the little sheet that protects the uh, screen, and here it is. So right here, let's see. This is the touch screen. This is the top screen, and this is the 3D switch. And the volume adjustments are no longer on this side. Or from now on, are going to be here. You have some speakers, a front-facing camera. So. And what's weird is that there's the new C stick that is not as movable. Not movable as the the C stick from the Nintendo GameCube controllers. So yeah, but the GameCube controllers it just rotates just fine, but this it doesn't. It's like the little laptop style nub pointing sticks, but it's just a joystick. So right here you get the circle pad, it did D pad. And you have the ABXY button layouts, but there's just the Super Famicom style. Instead of just being on the button, they're on the letters. So you have to start select buttons, the home button, this is the microphone, this is the LED 
and the hep from Jack is actually in the middle, just like the old 3DS from 2011. And that's a power button. So let's put this guy up. This is the blue LED. Okay. So, yep, there it is. Okay. Do you Nintendo 3DS XL? Uh, okay. We're gonna go English. Okay, so do a screen check. Okay, so I have to pay 3D. So I'm not gonna show you the 3D. So yeah, it does have face trap. Look at this, it's face tracking. Look at this, it's face tracking. <laughs> Look, continue. Alright, so it does have parental controls. So, it's already time day. I'm gonna turn off 3D here. So, it's December. And it's. Today is December 15th, 15th of December, oops, 2017. Alright, I'm gonna be right back, I'm gonna have to set the time. Okay, so I'm back, so with the set of the PM, they had the 24 time hours, so, so we're gonna go to our profile next. Okay, so you have to use the uh, stylus, but... Alright, so my name is Redbird. Okay, so alright, so I'm not gonna show you guys the my birthday date. But mine's on January 15th, which is next month. The three days before my birthday. Alright, as you know I'm in the United States. Alright, I'm not gonna say off my state I'm living. Alright, so Configure the internet. I'll be right back. I'm gonna be right back because I have to configure the internet. Alright, so I'm back. It's checking out my internet connection. Let's see. Oh, thank God it's successful. Alright, so. Alright, so here it is. And finish. Oh, oh. Oh, come on. Let's don't set it. I don't care for parental controls. Alright, so. Alright, let's go. Okay. Change for the Nope. Things complete now to go to the home menu. Parent to start the home menu. Okay. So, the new this roll. I'm using my AC adapter. So. Yeah, whenever the battery's gonna run out, and it's gonna die, I think. The battery. There we go. All right, the theme shop has opened. What's cool is it does have the. Th so it uses the micro SD card instead of a normal SD card. So yeah, I'm gonna use black to match the color. Oh yeah, the notification center. I'm not gonna read them all, so let me just pull the AC adapter. Oh, excuse me. There we go. Let's come on. It's better work. Oh, there it is. It's charging. So that means. Yeah, it does support Amiibo. So, so even if we look at play the games, example for your Smash. So I'm not gonna show you the gameplay. That's it. Thanks for watching. Please comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos of mine. Thank you for watching, and peace out.